when you think about what we've done down in Nalaman Fjord, we basically put the bow into the ice, right? But we had to go almost one mile or more, two or three miles through mm -hmm. dense ice to get there. Mm -hmm. Then with a normal shaft line vessel that has just normal propellers facing a stern, so you can give a stern and a head propulsion, nothing else. You cannot swing the pods around like what we have. We have a potted mm -hmm. vessel where we can swing basically the, the wash of the propellers to all sides. Then you would have a hard time to get out. Why? Because of course you are now heading into, let's say this is your your your, 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 your ice here, your, your loose pack ice with bergs and icebergs and bergy bits in, you're making your way through and then you hit the fast ice, right? Mm -hmm. All of this will close up behind you eventually while you do your operations, right? Mm -hmm. And now you have an issue because a stern, the stern is flat, right, of most ships. And so you cannot go a stern through the ice because you cannot break your ice a stern because you will start to push, push, push ice until mm. the ship doesn't go anywhere. So a stern you cannot get out. So you necessarily have to f turn the ship around again to get out. So, and, but in order to turn the ship around, you need some open water because in that dense ice, you cannot just turn the ship around. Mm. But our pods allow us to do so because we can, what I did when the ship was in, I left half of the hull stick out. Then I turned the pods around, constantly washing. So I was, I was basically directing the wash around the ship like that, motion. like that, until I had an opening that was big enough to move my ship into it. And then I, I started to angle it in that open basin. And then I started to wash again, do the same thing again. So I flushed again the ice until I could turn it more. So it took me about 30 minutes and then the ship was turned 180 degrees and then I could head straight back out. And that is only thanks to our pots. Uh, so, so, so to say that the propulsion can be can be a, a turn 360 degrees. If you don't have that, you are very limited in what you can do in this kind of in this kind of conditions. For me, it was the very first time I did that, mm -hmm. that I actually dared to go so deep into ice to reach the fast ice edge. I thought, when I saw it, I told Sean, it's not possible, mm -hmm. but it was, because the ship is super capable. Mm -hmm.